Welcome to my channel, Planet with Maserati. We are going to be doing a Erin Condren haul. So before I begin, I'd like to tell everybody welcome. Please subscribe, hit that post notification bell. So you don't miss out on any new videos, please give this video a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and share the video. That'd be great. We appreciate it. So that was my way of unboxing it. So yeah, I picked up a few things, and let's begin... Kind of a decent size haul. So they give you this, uh, The Dream Issue, Volume 6, so I'll be reading that later. So I picked up these notebooks. I'm hoping my other notebooks will fit into this journal cover. Let me try to bring this to, I don't know what is with my tripod. I left to go to work and it was fine and now it's like all over the place. So I have, well, do that last. I have these books here. I'm trying to see like what is going on. Diva, no! Oh my gosh, she's getting my nerves today. So there's this one where it says Petite Planner Focus Budget Book. Diva! Jesus. Can I get a minute to myself? Focus budget book, petite planner, and it's like the weekly. Seriously, Diva. Sorry. Weekly spending and monthly budget. And then she just climbs on whatever she wants. And then gold metallic stickers. And then it shows you how to do this. Let me close my door because my cat is going to drive me crazy. Now she's stuck in the room. So let me show you what it looks like. I don't know what is wrong with my tripod. Let me bring this down just a tad bit. It looks a little too high. Okay, there we go. Where is it open at? Oh, on top. Oh, that pretty little label is going to be messed up. Why do they do that? Oh, I like the way the book feels. This is my first time even opening, you know, the packages. So, it looked like a pocket. Oh my gosh. But you could stick a pocket there and put your seats. That's probably what I'll do. It says budget book. Every little bit adds up. This book belongs to. And then, of course, it has... Paper quality is nice. Petite planner on top, Erin Condren. So then you have your savings for so a month. You get like 12 months of what you're saving for. Deposit, total saved, savings for, deposit, total save. So you get a couple of them. So that's pretty interesting. Uh, your monthly overview. Two page spread. And then your spending summary. Oh, this would fill up quick. The month of. I don't know how many months you get of this. Because I really didn't check. It's a 5 by 7 times 8.25. You got 80 pages. It's not saying how many months. But this is just to get me like started with, you know, this kind of... Are you kidding me? She went on play today. <laughs> Spending summary, month of, and then month overview. So it's a very short, like, spending. So if you have a lot more spending, I mean, you're probably going to need a couple books. <laughs> because this does not give you much. And then in the back, it's supposed to have stickers. Yes, it does. Oh, that does come with a pocket. See, I knew something came with a pocket. No, but I thought it was the front side. But these are cute stickers. So you get a sticker sheet in the back. You get your pocket. Which, these are nice when they give you automatic pockets. In the back... Okay, so all this stays the same. It does go ahead and change in color. As you can see, like you get lighter. Some darker. Really darker. 
and then it says debit tracker. So you track your debit. You got a couple of pages of those. Again, spender, uh, spendery, spending summary. Yeah, so it looks like it's just the ending that's giving you the tracker. Not the tracker. What am I talking about? The debit tracker is at the end. But that is this one. I'll put these away as soon as I'm done. Then I picked up the Wonder Woman Petite Journal. Classic Wonder Woman. And it's Productivity Petite Journal. And again, they have it in the front. So let's see. How many pages you get in this one? 80 pages. So it's all the same size, so you know. I love the feel of these books. They are so pretty. Oh, that is super cute. So you have the Wonder Woman logo. Believe you can. And then it's lined. And then like a little note section. Different colors. This is really pretty. You get different colors on each page. So that's cool. Nope, no stickers. And it's just the same exact thing. It's like you could do a daily page, you could do a to-do list, you could do whatever. But yeah, that is that book. Hopefully it's not too high and not too short, because I don't know. I don't know who played with my tripod. The next is another Wonder Woman. This is Be the Hero. Petite Journal, Classic Wonder Woman, Lion Petite Journal. Now this one's in the back. Let's see, UPC, same size. 5x7 by 825. So that's an A5 size, I want to say. I think it's an A5 size, if I'm not mistaken. So I have enough journals for a while, and then you could pick up Dollar Tree journals this size, and then you won't have to worry about spending so much money. So here you have the lined paper with the little asterisk in the corner. You get it in every single page, except for on the back side. But the lines are pretty nice. You got the Wonder Woman logo. You have like little lines, you could put your name in it. I don't know if you can see that with the glare. Uh, it's hard to show you right there. And then in the back, it's just the Wonder Woman logo. There's that. But that's all this one is, is lined paper. Pretty interesting. Next is the Petite Journal. I'm not going to keep saying Petite Journal. Um, 80 page checklist pages. Metallic gold. Very nice. Okay, where's this one going? I'm putting the package underneath it so that I know which one goes to what. Because I have no idea. Oh, wait. I was doing that. <laughs> so this one says successful people are simply those success successful habits with those Successful people are simply those with successful habits. There you go. Say that a few times. So then you have the book belongs to with the little lines. And then this is just a tracker. You just track whatever. So this is pretty cool. This is interesting. I actually like this one. Next I look different, but yeah. So it looks good. You just track whatever you want. So it's all tracking. How cool is that? Next one is, I'm not going to say it. You get 80 line pages, metallic gold, colorful kaleidoscope journal. So we know what the journal looks like. It's just paper. Paper with lines. <laughs> if they go on clearance or something, I'd, I'd order them again. But if not, Diva, uh, you're stuck in here because I'm not opening the door. Yeah, walk away. She is either sick or 
I don't know. She has been acting crazy. So that is what it looks like. I like the design really nice. And again, it's just lining paper. So I do a lot of journaling and stuff. And that's what that one looks like. How cute is that? So again, 80 pages. The next one is, I'm trying to see if this is in the right order. Yeah, so July through September. The, there are, I was already cannot speak today. There are always good days ahead. And it's, again, planner July through September. It's a daily planner. Do you see that boiling? Do you see that boiling? It is so cute. Let me put the charger on. And of course, I have to drop stuff and move you. Sorry. Okay, there we go. We should be fine now. Let's open this one up. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not letting you out. You you pushed your way in. Find a way out. So this one is the daily spreads, and it has stickers as well. So it's probably a pocket back there. I'm taking it. But okay. Oh, it's not foiling. What is it? It's just purple, but it's like almost looks like foiling. It's kind of like matte, though. This is like a matte book. Oh, I love the color. Let's see, planner. How cute is that? Here's the monthly. So I need this like when I'm on the go and I need my appointments. This is perfect for me. This is like inserts I'm looking for where I don't have to keep making a daily planner and I have it right all in one place. This is perfect. Oh, this is nice. So you have like three. Okay, oh, I could do without the calendar. But it's workable because not every page right now has it. Because if it had it on here, I'd be screaming. No, I'm just kidding. So here's June 30th and then July 1st. So you have like three sections that you could put your own. You have like a to-do list. Oh, I like this. So Saturday and Sunday. I, they must not think Saturday and Sunday has its own life. Like, But they did put it on this side of the pages. So if you notice, it's all on this side. But here they have the three and then the to-do list. They have a to-do list and then whatever you choose on this pages for the weekends. But I do like the three because you could do like morning, evening, morning, afternoon, evening. Or you can change it up and do something else like your business or your um, social media, anything like that. But I do like this page. Yeah, I like this one a lot. And then it does change into colors. So once it finishes July, it goes to August in the goldish color. And then it goes into September. So you only get three months in here. September. And then you have the colors here. And it's a gradient color. So it goes from darker to lighter. And then in the back, a sneak peek, <laughs> strong foundation is built on infinity layers. And then you have your stickers and how stinking cute. Now this is foiling. Only one sheet though. It's so cheap. You have happy birthday, celebrate, to do, reminder, money, uh, shopping, asterisk, and exclamation point. But I like it. So that is that one. Okay. I think these people just hurry up for the fourth. So this one takes you from October to December. And that is foiling, I believe. It looks like it. Same concept. It's a daily planner, which I'll show you now. As soon as I can bust this thing open. about all these packages. Are we even filming? Yeah. So is it falling? You know, I can't even tell. It don't look it in like when I'm looking at it close up. But from afar it looks like it. Diva, I'm not letting you out. Sorry. I like the color. Again, this is my color. 
that I like. Diva, stop it! I am so sorry. This is the volume four because it's, you know, four months. I mean, a quarter, so January through March, April through, what, June, June, July through September, and then October through December. It says again, this book belongs to, you know I had to tell you that, like, I don't get this, like, why this? And it's in my daily page every single day, because I have a daily, um, Erin Condren daily, and it's on it every single day, so again... The weekend must fall, like, like the Friday. It must fall, like, where it's like that. But again, the month, and then it goes into, so here's November. And I'm just showing you basically this size because, I mean, I have so much stuff in front of me. And then December. It's good that it's a green color. And then again, you get this one. So the other one has purple foiling. This one has the blue. But it's exactly the same thing. So last but not least, you're probably wondering, like, why does she have all of these? Like, what is she doing with all of these? Right? Because I would be like, it's a lot of notebooks. Like, what are you doing with them? Well, I got my first sleeve. How cute is that? And I picked the camel color. It's an A5 notebook. The thing is, I want to make it into kind of like a pocket. So I might have to add pockets to it, but let's take this apart. We're only 16 minutes in. I did 7 books in 16 minutes. Are you serious? Okay, so the material is kind of squishy, and then like this, what's up with this? Okay, so how does this go? I know one changes the other. I don't like this thing right here. Like, those two are fine, but why this? Okay, so the middle is fine. Okay. I guess it stays loose. I don't know if I like that part of it. And then the strands are crooked. Oh, they're okay. So I guess it's like this. I guess it'll work itself out. But let me move these books because, yeah, this is not working out. So I'm going to put in the three books that I want. Well, how many strands do you get? Four. So you could jump as many as you want. So I'm going to put the ones that I'm not using away, and then I'm going to put my daily planner, which is the July through September, and I know the colors do not match. It is the camel side, the camel color. So this is the inside, and then this is the outside. It is a very squishy, floppy, leather-like planner. But I like it because I have everything. Okay, so I don't know why is it doing this okay do you see it it's like super loose and then how do you tighten all this stuff like so which one tightens this one do you know which one tightens okay that's that one this one's this one these two are tightened, but this one is super loose. Oh, maybe I have to tug at this one. Why is this so like this? Okay, so there you have it. Do I have to restring this? Because I don't feel like restringing this. Let me take this apart. Like, why did this come out like this? It's like so extremely, you can't really sh ex uh, change it because it's got the grommet on the, okay, I did not like this. I don't even know where I'm taking this to. Okay. Adjust yourself. Look at how loose this is. Does it change as the books are in there? 
It's like a map here. Okay, so let's put this one back in. Hopefully it works for the best. I don't like how loose it is. I don't think they are traveler notebooks kind of people. Because your notebook should not be this loose as you're putting it in. So then I'm going to grab this one. So that one again was the daily planner. I like the fact it has its own... Do I want the line book next? Or the habits? Or do I want the journals? Mm, decisions, decisions. Mm, I don't know if I want the budget book yet. So let's put in the kaleidoscope journal. Because one of them will be like my everyday journaling. And then one will be like my Bible journaling. And then when I'm ready for like adding my own books, then I'll do that. Okay, so I don't know. Oh, now it's making sense. Because now it's like, except for this middle one needs to be a little bit fixed. Okay, so how do I tighten these two? Is it this one or this one? This one's extremely tight. Okay, so... See, I don't like that. I don't like where the book is about to come out. So something is not adding up here. Okay. Why is this like this? Maybe I'll put the journal in the back for now. Work this strand. Okay, so where's this strand coming from? Okay, so there's that one. Okay, so that makes sense. And this is pulling this one? Oh, this is pulling this one. I'm so confused right now. Trust me, I am so confused. That's that one. So which one is this one pulling from? Okay, so I found it. I think now I have it. It's like you have to pull from one, go to another, pull from that one, go to another, pull from that one. I don't think I'll get another one of these from there. I was dying to have this, but then I'm like, this material is kind of cheesy. I mean, I'm not hating on it. Like, trust me, I'm not. Okay, so I need to pull this one. Or this one. No, let's see how this works. This is going to be a lot to get used to because I'm not used to, like, these strings. And how they're, like, in a weird place. Like, this one is, like, all up here and then all the way down here. Can you see that? It's like weird. Okay, so we have habits. We have another journal. We have our budget. What is Wonder Woman? Oh, I like the to-do look notes. So that's going to go in here. Yeah, we're setting this up ready. Might as well, right? This one. And then the last one is going to be another journal, I think. And then once this pulls... I think they'll all fall in place when they can. Because they're driving me insane. Okay, so it's going to be the last Wonder Woman. See how tight that one got? Okay. Now see, I like them when they're tight. I don't like them when they're loose. But I think this is better now. Wow, this is a lot of books. Okay, so see this strand? How do I fix that? So I have to go back in. I don't want to play with these things. I want to actually play with them. Okay, so let's adjust these. Go in here. See, it's this one here that needs to be adjusted. Uh, no, it's not that one. No, not that one. <laughs> 
I'm like going crazy here I'm trying to figure this out. Okay, so I'm just gonna leave it. So let me do a quick flip because the time is getting a little out of hand. See, look at that. Like, why? How do you fix that? It's too, too together. Like, it's got the four strands. I got that. But the books are like crazy. It's crazy town right now. The books are literally from here is over to here under. Like, how do you get it to equal out? And if you look here, it's like pulling so strong. So let's see how it holds. So it does hold well. I'm going to say that much. It is holding well. I think I'm going to get a pen loop. I'm going to order it on Amazon to put here. Maybe a color pen. Or I can make my own pen loop holder. That would be pretty cool. But I like it. I just don't like the books with the overhang. And I don't want to cut it. Like, I make my own books for cutting reasons. So, again, I will have some kind of pocket probably here. I think these should have came with some kind of pocket. It's very, like, flexible. I do like that. I don't have anything this flimsy, but I don't have anything that's, like, kind of padded. So I have my months, which is July through September in here. And then in October, I'll end up putting this one away and then bring it in the new one. So the daily planner. Here we have lined paper. So this will be my Bible journaling. Anything Bible related will go in here. You got 80 pages. My Wonder Woman is going to be my little to-do list kind of. Like your brain dump, things like that. I don't know exactly what I want to use it for. I'm going to look and see what people actually use it for. And then I'll go there. I'll do that route. And then the last book is, again, another lined. So that could be personal. That could be anything. Like any note taking, anything like that. And then in the back. And again, only two of them have stickers. Or was it three? Three, I think. The budget one, I think, had it. And I do not have that in here yet. I may end up putting it in here for July. Should I just do that? Or did I already start one for July? I gotta see. If I started one for July, then I won't. But if I didn't, then I'll put my budget one in here. And this is the back cover. This is the back. It does say the Erin Condren. So yeah, this is my haul and setup video. So if you like this video, again, give it a big thumbs up, leave a comment, share the video. That'd be greatly appreciated. As always, thank you for watching, and I will talk to you in the next video. Have a good one. Bye-bye.